Welcome back to another episode of The Daily Threat, your go-to source for the latest cybersecurity news and insights. Today we have a lineup of stories that underscore the ever-growing challenges in the world of digital security. Our first story takes us to the glamorous yet treacherous world of luxury brands, where cybercriminals are exploiting the allure of high-end products. According to a report from InfoSecurity, scammers have devised a cunning scheme to trick unsuspecting victims into divulging sensitive information and parting with their hard-earned money. Details reveal that attackers are leveraging sophisticated phishing techniques, often masquerading as legitimate luxury brand websites. These sites, meticulously designed to mimic the real deal, trick users into providing personal information and credit card details. The attackers then use this information for various malicious activities, including unauthorized purchases and identity theft. The risks for individuals are clear, but what about businesses? The potential damage to a brand's reputation can be severe, leading to loss of customer trust and financial repercussions. Now, let's delve into the anatomy of these attacks. The attackers employ social engineering tactics to create a sense of urgency or exclusivity, urging users to act quickly to secure limited edition items or exclusive offers. Once on the fake website, victims are prompted to enter sensitive information, which is then harvested by the cyber criminals. To protect against such threats, it's crucial for users to verify the legitimacy of websites, especially when dealing with high-value transactions. Always check for HTTPS in the URL, look for subtle design discrepancies, and never rush into providing personal information. In our second headline, we turn our attention to the financial sector, where the Industrial and Commercial Bank of China, ICBC, fell victim to a crippling cyber attack. According to Reuters, ICBC was targeted by cyber criminals who demanded a ransom after successfully disrupting markets. Details are scarce, but the incident raises critical questions about the preparedness and response strategies of major financial institutions. The fact that ICBC opted to pay the ransom suggests the severity and potential impact of the attack on financial markets. The attackers, employing likely sophisticated ransomware, were able to infiltrate ICBC systems, causing widespread disruption. The decision to pay the ransom is a contentious one in the cybersecurity community, as it can potentially encourage further attacks. However, it highlights the difficult choices organizations face when dealing with the aftermath of a successful cyber intrusion. For businesses in the financial sector and beyond, this incident emphasizes the importance of robust cybersecurity measures, including regular system audits, employee training, and effective incident response plans. Our final story brings us to a sobering warning from the Cybersecurity and Infrastructure Security Agency, CISA. CISA has issued an alert regarding actively exploited vulnerabilities in Windows, Sophos, and Oracle software. These vulnerabilities pose a significant risk to organizations using the affected software. Attackers can exploit these weaknesses to gain unauthorized access, execute arbitrary code, or even launch denial-of-service attacks. The active exploitation of these vulnerabilities underscores the urgency for businesses to prioritize timely software updates and patch management. In the digital age, where software vulnerabilities are continuously discovered, organizations must adopt a proactive approach to cybersecurity. Regularly updating and patching software is a fundamental practice to mitigate the risk of exploitation. As we wrap up today's episode, it's evident that the cyber threat landscape is more dynamic and challenging than ever. Whether it's the allure of luxury brands exploited by scammers, financial institutions grappling with ransomware attacks, or the ongoing battle against software vulnerabilities, vigilance is key. Before we go, a quick reminder to subscribe to The Daily Threat for your daily dose of cybersecurity news and insights. Stay informed, stay secure.